So you want to start a business, you have a great idea, you don't have anywhere to go, no one in your family's done a business, you don't have any relatives that are in business, this is the video for you. I'll show you a place where you can go and get free mentoring pretty much anywhere in the United States to help you construct your business, put together a good plan. And I'll also tell you about a phone scam that's going on in America that I want you guys to avoid so that you guys can keep making them life gains. Let's get into it. What's good, YouTube? It's the all-knowing, all-loving, all-feeling, all-seeing, all-powerful, just damn all everything, sexy as hell host of the Life Games channel, Lamont Tyson, bringing you guys streaming media, Cody stuff, Monday through Wednesday. Thursday night, we fire stick and chill so I can help you guys save some time and figuring out what it is you want to watch on TV and on your streaming devices or in the movie theater. And then for the weekend, it's all about how can I help you guys make money, save money, become a business owner, avoid scams, and give yourself that full circle that I like to call a life game. So we're talking, how can you get help with your business idea or find a mentor to help you get your business going? And I've used this service back in 2012. Me and my wife wanted to get into a business of childcare and owning the property. I was already doing something called Tyson Respiratory that I started from scratch on my own without a business plan, without business insight, and it just worked out. And so we had never done that type of business before. And before we got involved, we knew we was going to need a business plan and we knew we need to learn the data, the statistics that goes on with understanding how to do a business. And so we found this place called the SCORE. And it's right here on the screen. And its SCORE stands for Service Corps of Retired Executives. And what happens is this is an organization that is absolutely free to you in which you can go to their centers across the United States. And I have a link for the website in the description box. Just click on it, wait the five seconds for the ad, and then go ahead and go to the site. And they have different branches all over the United States in which you can go and get a free business mentor to help you construct a business plan outline a business plan, get business tutoring. If you're a minority or a woman, they show you where you can go to get those type of grants, those type of funding. Everything to help you guys get your business going from idea to actual business, they'll help you do it and they do it all for free. Let's take a look at some of the benefits they offer. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here's the vision and mission. Our mission fosters vibrant small business communities through mentoring and education. Our vision, every person has the support necessary to thrive as a small business owner. They provide you with volunteer mentors who share their expertise across 62 industries, free confidential business mentoring in person or via email, free business tool templates and tips online, inexpensive free business workshops that you guys can attend. So me and my wife, we utilized these services back in 2012. Because in North Carolina, with what I was doing with Tyson Respiratory, working with kids in the outpatient setting, we had already seen the evidence on the wall that the state was going to cut that budget. And so because I was already working with little children and going to daycares and having the opportunity to learn and see how the industry worked, we thought it'd be a good time to go ahead and start a child care property. I mean, child care business, excuse me. So what we did was we found a property, commercial business property, and we had never known how to get it and all that. So we went to them, they guided us on how to do a business plan, and to this day I saved that plan, and here it is. Tyson Place business plan done in 2012, September, and the score helped us do it. And thankfully, in that business plan, it taught me how to create exit strategies and backup plans in case the original plan didn't work. So what did we do? We was gonna buy the property, own and operate and run a child care center in the property. Well, the child care center didn't work out for us. So what was my backup plan? To become a commercially property lease owner. So now we're leasing the property and thankfully through doing a good business plan, I was able to survive having to close a business, but still utilize the business plan the way that we wrote it so that that commercial property is making good money for us. And when we got the property, it was trash. Even the trash of the property was valued at about $450,000. 
After we cleaned it up, we turned it into this thing right here that you see that bears our name, Tyson's Place. Renovated it. It's sitting on 2.25 acres, commercial property, and we're getting a pretty large sum of rental income from that thing every single year. And it was all done because I got great help from those mentors at the score. So all of you guys that are saving your money, you're following my tips, and you're thinking about getting into the business, I highly recommend you guys look up the score Give them a call and see how they can help you guys turn your business ideas into reality. And that's a life gain on that. Moving right along. I want you guys to be very careful nowadays. The scamsters, man, these dudes are just as sophisticated as technology keeps going forward. And by saying that, I don't want you guys to be afraid of technology. We don't want to become stagnant. Whenever something comes up, you're going to always have those that are going to figure out ways to try to take advantage of you. There's no different from this phone scam. When someone will give you a call, bring, bring, you answer the phone, you'll say, hello. They'll say, can you hear me? And you're gonna instinctively say yes. Guys, don't do it. When you say yes, these people are recording your voice and using that voice likeness to approve you for credit cards and accounts that you don't know about. So what they're saying from the local police departments and other bodies that help make sure you don't get taken advantage of is if you see a call from a number that you never recognize or an unidentified call and black people been doing this forever. I think black people enjoy the use of call ID more so earlier than anybody else on this planet, boy, because that thing was good to us. If you don't recognize that number or it's an unauthorized call or you, it's private, don't answer it. Just don't answer it. Let it go to voicemail. If it's all that important, they're going to leave you a voicemail. And in that voicemail, they're going to leave you good details about what you need to do. Just don't answer it. I don't want you guys to get taken advantage of in this manner because I've heard it's hit a lot of people, and particularly our elderly folks who don't want to cut their home phone lines, ladies and gentlemen. So if you've got a loved one that's a little older that you know, please let them know. If they don't recognize the number, don't answer it. And if they do pick it up and somebody says, can you hear me? Have them say something else that's a little obnoxious like, who the hell is this? That's how you get away with that and avoid that scam. All right, guys, well, I hope this video is able to help you make those life gains and whatever your business endeavors are, hopefully it'll help you avoid dealing with this phone scam. And that's going to do it for this video, ladies and gentlemen. Don't forget to like this video, comment and subscribe. Go out there and get yourself a life game. If some of you guys want to get a copy of my business plan, hit me up. Be sure to check my link below for the SCORE website. Do business with me. Do business with my affiliates. And until the next sexy as hell video, I'll see you guys.